Good morning, Internet. Uh, heading off to first meeting of the day. Maybe the only meeting. I don't remember now. But um, got in the van. It's cold. It's a cold blooded van. But how does this happen? Can you? I don't know if you can see that or not. The, the little snowflake particles are. I know I'll be corrected. Or snowflake particles, but on the windshield. But then you get these ones over in the corner that are these lines of. I don't know. Um, how does that happen if that even comes through on the video? Uh, it's a curiosity. It's kind of strange. I, I know I've seen it before, but I never really thought much about it. Um, what causes it to go in a line like that instead of just the. You know the, the dots and stuff so question for you today did you uh you know this morning i was looking or i was driving i thought of something to talk about and thought oh yeah that'll be great and i just get somewhere nice backdrop or something and go ahead and uh talk about that well Got to a place where I can sit and record a little bit with my own thoughts. <laughs> I don't remember what it was. Um, there's a, it's an interesting new year. Um, lots of things up in the air. Lots of things I don't know the answers to. Um, I'll find the answers and I'll get them. But when you're sitting there without knowing where things are going to end up or what's going on or any of that stuff, you're, you're kind of at a loss. But you got to remember that through everything, the only person responsible for your own happiness is you. Um, and that's something I'm, I'm trying to keep in mind. Um, for the most part I do alright but every once in a while you, you forget you know and you think oh if, if just this would happen or that would happen but you can't rely on those on those things to happen you know when they're when they're supposed to they will um, if they're supposed to they will you just you just gotta keep going and and know that the, the end result is going to be, you know, worth it. Um, there's lots of good things going on right now. There's lots of things I wish were different. Um, but they are what they are. And you're only wherever you're at in life because of the decision, decisions you have made up to this point. Um, and you can't second guess those past decisions. They're in the past. You can't do anything about them. Um, you know, the, the past is just that, the past. Uh, you have to let it go. Um, let it shape who you are today. But don't let it affect who you're going to be any more than you want it to. Um, you know, there's, there's lots of things I'm doing different now. Um, different focuses that I have. Um, things that are truer to how my thinking. And not everybody around you always gets that. You know, not everybody understands that what you're doing is because that's what you feel you need to do it has nothing to do with them it's not meant as a slight towards them or anything negative it's just what you feel you need to do and as long as you stay true to yourself I feel the rest of it will eventually fall into place it may not always make for the smoothest of times um, or the most workable of times but the only person you're gonna be with 
you know, for sure, every day of your life is you. And if you don't like who you are, you're not going to like anybody that's around you either. Um, I'm not trying to get all philosophical and, you know, that's not the purpose of all this. The, in fact, that brings up a good point. I, I started this a couple of years ago, um, you know, watch a couple of the other YouTube bloggers and stuff, vloggers, whatever you want to call them. And I thought, oh, I could do that, you know, and I can, I can get famous like, you know, Shay Carl and Charles Nally and Billy D and all these other YouTube rock stars and whatever, but I never committed to it fully because um, I always wanted to be like them. Well, this time around, I decided to do it just for me. Um, yeah, it's going up in a public place. Everybody can look at it. Everybody can ridicule it. Everybody can criticize it. Everybody can judge it. Um, decide what my motives were. Um, but I know what I'm doing it for, and I'm just doing it for me because I want to start chronicling what's going on and I want to do it in a public way um, to make myself accountable to myself. Um, you know, if, if I just recorded these and stuck them on my computer somewhere, okay, I could delete them in a couple of years or a couple of months or tomorrow. And who would know? Who would care? Who, you know, and not that anybody cares now or that these are going to mean anything to anyone other than me. They're not meant to. They're they're meant for me, by me, to me. Um, I figure a couple years from now, maybe I'll look back at them and uh, see what I was thinking at different parts of my life. You know, and if I do this, daily gets to be a bit much. Um, I may try to record something daily. It may have, I, it may not even have me in it, like the, you know the fireworks last night. But I just thought January one, it's a good day to start, um, start new things, and create new traditions and new, new things in your life to do. So this is one of the things I'm doing. I don't expect anyone or want anyone or need anyone to understand it or accept it or any of that stuff it's you know like I said it's it's only for me um, you know but maybe if I keep posting them online you know maybe somebody will see it and uh, something I'm going through at some point they'll realize they're not the only one doing it or you know or maybe not I mean maybe nobody will ever see them who cares um, so I guess that's my big thought for the day. <laughs> um, one thing I guess we'll start discussing me more, you know, because it's all about me, isn't it? That's the whole purpose of this. Um, back Thanksgiving, we went out to visit my sister, went and saw, just went to church with her at Central, or yeah, Central Christian Church out in uh, Henderson, Nevada. And uh, <clears throat> I've been there before. I've been to lots of churches before. I've been to other churches like that before. But for some reason, that time something clicked. And it's just something I want to do now, kind of like these videos. It's just something I decided I want to do. Um, nobody else needs to do them with me. You know, I, I get the questions, you know, oh, you're not making your son go or any of your kids go or anything no because while I'm here to guide them and help teach them I'm not here to make them do what they're not ready for um, you know there may be a particular time that I'll tell them, come on you know come along with me but not yet not until I'm much more comfortable um, with the church um, that I'm you know feeling at home there I mean I, I am 
I like the one I picked. I'm going to the Heights Church, which actually I'm sitting up in their little field right now. Um, it's set up for a Christmas walk thing. I didn't even realize it, that's what all this was up here. Um, but I figured, you know, I'm passing right by here. Let's stop and take a look. So that's part of what's going on now. And then the other thing I think I'll do with these videos is um, start marking or chronicling places I go around town, places I go and eat, stores I go into, the little things that make all the, you know, the quad cities, Prescott, Prescott Valley, Chino, um, Dewey, out to Jerome sometimes, um, you know, just different places we go. I go, I guess. Um, just kind of chronicle what's there and and give my feedback on it. Not that anybody cares about that, but just to add something else to, to all this. Won't be every day, won't be every week or every month, but uh, just something more to do. So uh, that's about it. I just wanted to kind of give a rundown of the purpose and the reason that I'm doing this. Um, it's not for, like I said, it's not for anyone else or anything. You're probably tired of hearing me talk, so I guess we'll head on out now. Um, so this is the, as long as we're up here, this is the big church area. There's a big cross back behind me. Um, made out of like a bunch of scrap iron and stuff. It looks like it's kind of cool that they used old, old stuff and, and made that up. So, um, yeah, I guess that's about it. We'll uh, talk to you guys later. You know, I'll have to come up with some sort of a way to end my videos. You know, I know Charles does doodles and um, some of the podcasts I listen to, they do things. Oh, that's something else. We're going to start doing podcasts. That's one of the things for the business, though. Um, tech related podcast of some sort. I haven't decided what newsletter i've got all kinds of big plans for the for the company but um those will be rolling out over the next couple weeks like i said starting off the new year trying to get all these things going so talk to you guys later thanks a lot